from journal jot and jive if this is your first time and by the end of the video you like it remember to hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so every time i post you are in the know y'all while well, i'm out of breath i just came down the stairs anyway it's monday and on monday we do movement mondays that's the day where we typically will set up our fitness page and then we will also if we have time, look at other sections in the planner and set up things that we plan to make moves on, okay? All right, so this Monday has already started off a little, a little different. I was like, oh, let me multitask and wash clothes and all that great stuff. Y'all, I get upstairs, I knock my hand and knock my nail off. So this week already was scheduled to have, get these things done because you know the half moon is already showing. But I'm like, oh my God. That is horrible. All right, so let's roll on to the fitness page. So remember the other week, I made a mistake and skipped. So we're going to back track and just fill these in. And so what we're going to do in the fitness section is we're going to take this insert that is a Annie's printable, and we're going to repurpose it. Instead of it being a meal tracker, it will be a fitness tracker. So I need to cover up the word grocery list and... Then we'll get rolling with it. I'll be using a variety of books. I don't know what all books. I do know a few will be fitness books. And then I'll be using some fitness stickers. And we'll go from there. So I think I'm going to go ahead and make my color scheme flow off of these colors right here. And that is what we're going to do. Now, y'all know how this goes. Will this be a talk through? I don't know, maybe the first part. I can tell you that I did weigh in and I didn't like it. I ain't like it at all. Um, but every week I do go in and we're gonna write how much I weighed. Like you can't run away from stuff because you don't like the outcome or the results, okay? So we are going to definitely write this weight down that I looked at this morning and was like, girl, what are you doing with that? All right, so let me go in my little sticker book. And we are going to find some stickers from Oso oh Paper Co. She has one where you're standing on the scale. So let's pull her out. And let's roll with this blue one. We're going to put her right there. And y'all, I am a whopping 176. This weight did go up. Now, what I can say, the weight went up, but I did exercise all week except two days. So, five out of seven. No complaints there. So, we're going to do, um, I was 176.7. So, honey, I'm 177. You know how they try to play like, oh, I'm 176. Mm -mm, you learned in math. If it's after five, you round up. So, I'm 177 pounds. No, thank you. All right, so that's the weight that's put in there. And I am going to do the seven minute workout again because that actually is actually working in reference to consistency. Um, but I probably will intensify it a little bit and maybe add some weights with some of the exercises. And then I also have to increase this water a little bit more than last week I do have my water bottle sitting right here y'all this is the coldest water bottle I actually love this water bottle um this is actually a tumbler right here they have the water bottles with the straw but y'all it is a lifetime warranty water bottle it has stainless steel and it keeps your water cold for over 24 hours so yeah I use it um I do it is an affiliate type of thing so I do get a small percentage if you purchase it but I wouldn't sell anything I don't believe in so if you're trying to get your water kick and you want your water to stay cold all day long I would recommend that bottle the link will be in my description and the particular cup that I have right now that one is a um that one's $19.99 so that would be my suggestion to you all all right so we put down drink more water and then we're going to go in and write 
the week. We are in March, the week of March 18th through the 24th. And so that's the week we're in. So we already decided that we're gonna stay with the seven minute workout. And we also need to eat well. Now we'll tell you starting today for dinner today and tomorrow night nah, ain't gonna be that well. I've already planned it. We're doing a seafood boil today, y'all. I have been like hooked on these mukbang videos. If you don't know what a mukbang video is, if you can't stand smacking and all of that, and I really can't, um, I would not recommend you even trying to figure out what it is because it may make your flesh crawl because it's just that type of video. But I've been watching a lot of seafood mukbang videos, and I'm like. I want it so since I want it three four five I'm gonna so we're gonna do a seafood boil tonight and then taco Tuesday and then after that for most of the week y'all in all honesty I believe I'm gonna do more of a veggie based meal plan so I'll have some carbs but not a lot but I won't be really eating meat for the rest of the week so I'll do more of a vegetable base and then I'll fit the carbs in, whether it's sweet potatoes, quinoa, um, something of that sort, brown rice. I'll be doing that. Oh, these colors are not going to go because I'm running out of the pattern. Okay, so this pattern is going to be off a little bit. So yeah, y'all, that's how I am going to do that. So... That's what's going to be going on this week. So, seven minute workout. Change that eating up a little bit more. And then incorporate some weights as well. Um, now, one thing when you do weights, you will see a, a change in your weight. Your weight might go up a little bit. And then you'll see a decrease in your weight. So you can't, sometimes you can't always go by the scale. But right now I can go by the scale because my stomach says so. Like, yeah, I got to get, definitely have to get that weight up off of me. All right, so the seven minute workout really to me is like a total body workout. So I would classify it more as cardio. It's really um, hit, but we're just going to put cardio on all the sides of these. And then I'll go in and write seven minute workout. And then we'll be done with this page. Like I said, all that cutesy stuff, it really doesn't make any sense right now until I'm really putting in moves. Then I can do all that super cute stuff. But right now, I, I gotta push a little bit more. Like I said, increase that, wa that water, get these workouts in, and do that. Like, um, And again, last week I did five out of the seven. This week I wanna go four seven. This does not mean you have to work out seven days, but with this being a shorter type workout, I really need to push myself to get to the seven days at least. And if I don't do that, it needs to be six. It needs to be more than what I did last week. So my goal is always to push past my comfort zone. All right. And so we said that this will be the seven minute workout. So I'm going to go ahead and put the little box on the side of each before I write the words and then I just check off if I did it or not and then I write again the seven minute workout because we know that's what we want to do now with the seven minute app you can find it on your phone it should be in your app store the cool thing about it is they have a variety of seven minute workouts you can do they have the workouts that are you can do an arm workout glute workout so you can change the type of seven minute workout that you do so that's really cool if you tend to get bored easily I may look at some different ones this week I might do arms on one day possibly I might add an addition to it but it's really cool so check it out if you haven't already so we're doing seven minute workout and then we're just gonna go down and write this each time and so you want to track what you're doing. And even if you have a day that you did not work out, make sure you go in and say you didn't work out. Like, stop running from your truths because even though you're not admitting to it openly, it still exists. So you want to see, like, what days do you tend not to work out? Is there a pattern in the days that you do not work out? And if it is, you want to break that pattern. So if you say, I know every Monday I find an excuse not to work out, you need to find an excuse to work out. So you want to change up 
whatever you keep repeating. And then that's how you're going to change that bad habit. So again, check out the app. It's seven minutes out of your day. This video was probably past seven minutes. It is. So you could have worked out while listening to this video. All right. So we have that in there. And yeah, I think that's going to be it on this video. Not this video. On this section. Because I don't really want to make it. I don't want to overdo it. There's no need to. We need to do the work. The end. All right. So that is that. I thought I wanted to do another part of this uh, planner, y'all, but I don't think I want to on film. I can show you that I already set up my weekly overview. I'm going to go and look at my brain dump list and write that stuff in there. I can tell you real quick what this does right here. This is my social media schedule. This is what I need to do, the main things that I need to do for the week. I do have an event coming up that I need to attend on Saturday. It's a white breakfast brunch and things I need to buy, notes. And then anything else over here. But yeah, nah, I don't feel like doing this on camera, so I'm not. <laughs> so I'll go in and fill this in after I finish editing and uploading the video. I will be coming on later this evening for Monday Motivation. I'm pretty sure I will see some new faces as we'll be discussing why A. Renee had to cancel her Jeans Journal and Java event. So I hope to see you all there, but let's... Be mindful that it is about Monday motivation, so we will be doing our Monday motivation journal entry, our quotes, um, uplifting each other. So do know that that's the whole purpose of that this evening. So I hope to see you all there. And I'm going to go ahead and get the rest of my day going. Y'all have a great Monday. Remember, Monday didn't do it to you. Your mood did, so adjust your mood and your Monday will go better. Until next time.